Hey, Shad here with Speed Addicts, the fastest growing gear site on the web. And today we're gonna uncrate the Cortec Chicane Jacket. What's up, Speed fan? Before we jump in and give you the download on the Cortex Chicane, do us both a favor, subscribe to that Speed Addicts channel. Go ahead, I'll wait, it only takes a second. And that way you're up to date on the latest gear coming your way. We're always working hard here to educate you. If you subscribe, you will not miss out. Also, to support us here at Speed Addicts, you can do so by simply shopping with us. We're gonna make it real easy to get over to the chicane jacket at speedaddicts.com. There's a link in the description below that will do that for you. While you're over at Speed Addicts, feel free to shop for any other parts or gear you might need for your next two-wheel adventure. Okay, Cortec, lead, leading producer for a number of decades in the sport and sport touring segments. They make jackets, pants, gloves, and boots, all for affordable prices. They all carry a two-year warranty, and dollar for dollar, they're pretty good stuff. Now, the chicane jacket is a perforated leather jacket here coming in at only 220 bucks. So if you're looking for a sport or sport touring leather, Jacket that is perforated, gonna flow some air. It's gonna be well under that $300 price point and save you some cash. Worth considering here. Multiple colorways available. Chicane's been around for a minute and you're gonna see sizes small through three extra large. Now, listen carefully because the fit is a little bit off. We're noticing the chicane running a full size small. So I'm a 44 inch chest, 220 pounds, 6'2", and this XL is not cutting it. It is too small all over and I need it. I need the 2X extra large. Extra large on the sizing chart from Cortec is supposed to fit a 44 inch chest. And even after breaking, we're just not gonna get there. Now all the armor is installed. It's also a little bit short, kind of all over for me. So go to the sizing chart at speedix.com and round up a full size. You've been warned on the fit, uh, but a full size will do it. And you are getting a full suite of CE level one armor. Now when it comes to fit and shopping for gear online, we know you don't always get it right the first time and that's why you really should be shopping with us here at Speed Addicts because we're going to cover you with no cost returns. That's right. We don't nickel and dime you like those other jabronis. We're going to give you a free return label, treat you like family, get a different color, get a different size. Whatever you got to do, we're going to hook you up. So enough with my shameless plugs. Back to the chicane jacket here. So Genuine buffalo leather construction. That's right, I'm not buffaloing you. It's actually made out of buffalo, kind of interesting. We don't see that every day. My suspicion is that the buffalo hides are a little bit less than that bovine leather in terms of cost, helping keep the, the overall cost of the garment down here. Perforated leather panels. It's hard to see on the black, but this is all perforated on the chest. You have more perforation on the back. We have a sport fit with rotated sleeves. Of course, they are in the direction of where your handlebars will be, right? So pre-curved arms, pretty standard stuff on a sport jacket. You're going to get four-way stretch in the crook of your arm. This is all a stretch material here. It's kind of a tough textile with a lot of stretch to it to help mobility. And you also get that in the gussets on the, uh, the arms, under arm section. It's gonna flow more air than that leather too, so it's gonna help this jacket breathe. You have CE level one armor in the elbows, shoulders, and an Eva foam back pad. So you have a full suite of armor. It is all removable. So if you wanna step it up, go to level two. You can purchase that separately. You wanna go a little fancier, you can get a set of D3O armor. There goes armor, it's real nice and low profile there. So that is the protection. Velcro waist adjustment down low. Pretty straightforward stuff, so you can cinch that down. We have zippered cuffs. I have them open here so that they can open up and fit over your glove with locking YKK zippers so they kind of stay where you put them and don't blow around as you are ripping down the highway there. Uh, you also have an additional Velcro strap here to really cinch this down, although I think it's kind of unnecessary. Um, the, uh, the zipper does bring this down pretty tight, so that should be sufficient for most of you. In terms of other storage pockets, you have your standard slash pocket over here on both sides. These are a little bit small, but uh, they do the job. I can fit my mitts in them. You have a removable thermal liner in here with one storage pocket on your right side and nothing hiding over here on the left. You get a little snap pocket up top. So all the storage is over here on your right. There's nothing 
hiding. Whoop, actually, I lied. There is a matching mirrored pocket that is hiding over here underneath the thermal. And this is just kind of part of the mesh inner liner. Let's zip this down so we can show you Oops, what that looks like. Here you go. So there's the interior mesh, and there is that pocket that I showed you that's hidden by the thermal liner and uh, is meant to receive a phone. So that's the internal storage on this. You do have reflective striping on the front, on the cuffs, and on the back. A little bit extra visibility for you. And you have a zipper to pant pocket that I'm going to show you on the back here. If I flip this over, perhaps we can get there. <clears throat> and that is the back of the jacket, again, with those gussets and the perforation. That about does it. Up at the top, you do have, in addition to the zipper, which I already showed you, this is running a little bit tight on me, but let's bring it up one more time. You also have this little Velcro strap, which I think is totally unnecessary. They could have just done without that. This is just going to be annoying there. Uh, the zipper is doing the job. This is kind of just redundant. I might even pull that off if I was going to purchase the chicane. To your warranty from Cortec, that does it. About $200 for a genuine buffalo leather jacket with a full suite of armor. If you still got questions, Speed Addicts are standing by. Our rider support team is expert and they will walk you through any sort of gear purchase you might need to do over the phone, emails, or live chat. Also, remember, if you have one of the chicane jackets, go ahead and drop us a comment in the comment section below. That's all I got for you. See you next time to find out what's in the crate.